Hello, my name is Ed Frawley, I own Learbird. We're going to take a couple seconds here and talk about the bite pillow or the bite wedges that we sell. They go by different names. Some people call them a wedge, some people call them a bite pillow. We sell a number of different kinds. You can go to our website and see the full selection. But what we're talking about here is this three-handled bite pillow or bite wedge. We import it from Germany. This is a, a top quality uh, piece of training equipment. It's covered in jute. Uh, here's a Here's the same product that is two years old, uh, been used on a number of adult Malinois, and while there's a difference, there's very, very little wear on this two-year-old bike pillow that we use here in our own training center. For those that have never trained uh, a dog in the biting sports or police service work before, the bite pillow or the bite wedge is an intermediate step in protection training. Um, Young dogs start by learning how to play tug. This is all covered in our uh, videotape on the power of training dogs uh, with tugs. Uh, so people will start with, uh, with the tugs and then they'll move on into bite pillows. Uh, as I said, there's a number of different kinds. This one has three handles. Some of ours have a handle in the back and you can actually slip your arm into them with a handle on the inside. We sell bite pillows or bite wedges that are two-handled bite wedges, uh, and we sell smaller ones for little bitty puppies. Uh, if you're training dogs for uh, some of the leg biting sports or police service work, uh, those dogs need to learn how to bite the legs. We cover this in uh, our training DVDs, but you can, this, these kinds of pillows allow you to hold the dog or hold your, your bite pillow down here so when the dog comes in, he grips it here and then you can play tug with him, release it. You can put a, a line on it so that when you release it, you can play tug with the dog when it goes away. Uh, and, and again, the dog comes the other way. You can hold it like this and train your dog that when he comes in, he bites like this. We always want to have the bite to the outside, uh, eyes to the outside for safety and that's explained in details in our DVDs. So, if you're training a dog uh, in any of the biting dog sports, you're going to need a bite pillow or a bite wedge. Uh, a lot of people that are not going to train dogs in protection sports buy these products from us because it's a good toy for a dog. If you have a dog that likes to chase and play tug, this is a perfect uh, toy to use for them. You don't need to be in police service work. You don't need to be in Schutzen or the ring sport. Uh, to have a dog, to, to require one of these with your dog. They're just, it's a good little training product. Okay.